everyone and welcome back to another video. It literally feels like so long since the last time I filmed a sit down video like this. I think it has literally been like at least six weeks since the last time. So it feels really really weird sitting down in front of the camera with a ring light on and filming a video like this. But today I am going back to my roots and I'm going to be filming an active wear haul slash review type video. So as you can see by the title, all of today's items are from Bowen T, which is Opoly's active wear brand. So Bowen T actually reached out to me and asked if I wanted to do a video with them. So they let me choose three different sets um, to kind of review and try on and show you you guys on this video. So big shout out to Bowen T, thank you very very much for sending me these sets. Um, I just cannot believe that Bowen T are like sending me free clothes to do a video, like it's actually crazy to me. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so so much. But yeah, let us get into showing you these outfits. So like I said, I got to choose three different sets. So I've got a mixture of actually leggings and shorts and tops and sports bras so I've got quite a good variety. I chose them all from different collections just so that we could get like a nice variety and a nice mixture in the video. I've not tried any of them on or anything yet so it's all going to be first impressions in this video. I'm going to start off with the one that I think is going to be my favourite. So this set is from the Spectra collection and I've got leggings and a sports bra in this one. So we'll start off with the leggings. So I have had a couple of pairs of these same leggings before and I absolutely love them. I have mentioned them in previous videos. I just think like they fit so well, they're such a nice material, they're really flattering, really comfy. So as soon as I saw that it brought out some new colours, I definitely had to pick a set up. Um, so this colour is called Rose. It's a really nice like kind of dusky pink colour. The leggings themselves, they're high waisted. The waistband is nice and compressive. It sucks you in. You've got the little bow and tee logo on the front. Full length, seamless leggings. They honestly feel so, so silky. They are such a nice material. And on the back, they have a scrunch bum down the middle and then they've got some contouring like around the side and under the bum as well. The only thing that I'm a bit worried about with this color is it is quite light. So I don't know if it's gonna be like completely squat proof or if it's going to be a little bit see-through, um, but we'll find out when we try them on. And then to match the leggings, I got this sports bra. The description on the website actually says crop top rather than sports bra, so I think it's kind of like a bit of a like halfway point between the two. So it's got like padding and stuff in it, so I think it is still going to be quite supportive, but it's like a little bit longer than your average sports bra. So if you maybe want like a little bit more coverage when you're in the gym, this is going to be perfect for you. It's high neck as well. The straps, it's really hard to show, but they cross over on the back and they're also adjustable, which I think makes all the difference in a sports bra. The padding is also removable, so it's up to you whether you want to keep that in or take it out. Um, yeah, I'm excited to see what this set looks like on. So these leggings are exactly as I was expecting. They're exactly the same as the other ones that I've got. They fit really well. They suck you in on the waist. They just feel so nice and soft on your skin. The top fits really nicely. I think it's quite nice to have like a bit of a high neck because most sports bras do tend to be like a little bit lower. So it's nice to have that little bit extra coverage there. And it is a little bit longer as well. So if you don't want to have too much of your tummy on show, this is like a really nice set for you. The top is actually a little bit more supportive than what I thought it was going to be as well. Um, I don't know if I would want to like do loads of jumping in it. But you definitely get away with it for like some types of cardio and definitely like weight training and stuff as well. With the leggings, I would definitely recommend wearing like some lighter pants or like a nude colour if you've got some. Because they are a little bit see-through. Um, I have like dark pants on at the moment and I don't think you can see them at the front. But on the back, when I look in the mirror, I can definitely see like the top of the pants so definitely some lighter ones are needed if you're going to be wearing this pink colour. Yeah, so moving on to the next set, this one is from the Accelerate collection and I've never had sort of anything similar to this from Bowen T so I've got no idea what to expect. Um, but for this one I went with a pair of shorts and a top so a little bit different to the last set. These are the shorts, so it's in this really nice teal colour, it's kind of like an acid wash as well. 
that's the wrong way around <laughs> this is the front so they're kind of like a bit of an acid wash as well just kind of like your standard sort of gym shorts high waisted again they seem to be quite compressive on the waist I think that they will be quite a nice length I don't think they're going to be too short and then on the back again we've got a scrunch bum and a little bit of bum contouring like around the side and under the bum it's not quite as in your face as the pink ones this one is a little bit more discreet but it's still there and it's also got like the bow and tee logo in like a sort of plasticky rubbery thing on the back so this collection comes in like a nice sort of rib material. I have had a pair of, a couple of pairs of ribbed leggings from Bow and Tee in the past. Not this exact design, but I always think that they are quite, they do feel like quite nice quality. They feel like a lot more expensive than what they are, which is always nice. And then to match the shorts, I've got this long sleeved crop top in that same teal colour. So again, this is like that ribbed material, but the top feels like it's a lot thicker than the shorts which I find a little bit strange because with it being long sleeved I personally would rather have this a little bit thinner so it's not as warm and then the shorts a little bit thicker um, so yeah I found that like a little bit weird but we'll kind of wait and see what it's like when we try it on but yeah this has got quite like a nice detail on it so it's long sleeved like I said crop top and it's got this like zip detail that runs across the front which I thought was something quite different Um, I wonder if it opens actually yeah it does so you could wear it open if you wanted to i don't really know why you would want to but i mean the option is there but yeah i think that this set is gonna look really nice on like i said i really like the color i'm just hoping that this top's not gonna be too hot because it does feel quite thick um but yeah we'll see when we try it on okay so i am so obsessed with this color i absolutely love it the shorts they fit really nice and they are quite a nice length as well um i personally like shorts that are sort of like mid thigh length because they're not too short where your bum's going to be hanging out in your workout but then i sometimes find like the biker shorts that are a bit longer aren't as flattering and um, so i really like this sort of length it it works really really well for me the shorts are really stretchy, really comfy, you can like move in so many different directions, like I wouldn't feel restricted at all wearing these, which is a massive thing for me when it comes to the gym. The top, as I expected, like it is a little bit thick, but it's not too bad. Um, I would definitely still wear it in the summer, not for like a cardio session, maybe for a leg session if it was like raining. Um, but yeah, if it was quite a hot day, I would probably only want to wear it for like an upper body session where I'm not kind of going to be getting too sweaty or too hot. But again, the fit of it's really nice. It's a really nice stretchy material, even though it's quite thick, it's got a lot of give to it, which is really nice. And yeah, I just think like it just works really, really well. It's a little bit tight across here, um, but like it's not to the stage where like I wouldn't be able to wear it. Um, but yeah, I really, really like this set. The colour is just everything. I know I'll keep going on about it, but the colour is just everything. And yeah, I, I like this kind of more than what I was expecting. So... So the third and final set that I got is from the Overload collection. So this set, it's not like a matching set, but I would still wear them together and it does still technically match, but it's not like matching top and bottoms, if that makes sense. So we'll start with the leggings. So they're this really nice, like, apple green colour. I absolutely love green at the moment, especially, like, this sort of shade. I just think it is so, so nice. So these leggings, again, they're that ribbed material. I think these are the same leggings that I've had previously from Bow and Tee that are ribbed. They do feel, like, very, very similar to what I remember my other ones being like. So they're ribbed, seamless, full length leggings. They literally don't have any detail on them at all. Just the little Bow & Tee logo on the front. And then the back, pretty plain, pretty simple. These ones don't have like any bum contouring or any scrunch bum or anything. It's literally just your standard pair of leggings. I think these are gonna feel quite nice on. They're a nice sort of like thick 
thick material and like I was saying before the ribbed material that Bow & Tee do it does feel like quite expansive which is always really nice and I don't think I'm going to have any issues with those being see-through or anything uh, but yeah I just absolutely love that colour I don't have any gym stuff in this colour so I'm really really excited to wear these to the gym and then to match that like I said it's not like the matching set but it does still look quite nice together so it's this little sports bra it looks really really weird kind of seeing it like this but I just thought it was like something a little bit different I was originally going to get the green sports bra to match the leggings but they didn't have it in my size so when I saw the white one I was like well white goes with anything so I can just wear that as a set and I'll be able to wear this with like lots of other things as well so I thought I would pick it up it's the same like rib material again it feels like quite thick and quite expensive I do think that Bow & Tee are quite good at doing like different sort of designs like stuff like this that not many other brands do it's a pretty plain sports bra all it's got is a little Bow & Tee logo on the front there this sports bra doesn't have any padding or anything in it. I'm not a hundred percent sure how supportive this is going to be. I'm obviously, like, I just I don't I don't think it's going to have much support to it at all. But I mean, it looks cute. So, <laughs> so first impressions of this one. I really like this set as well. These leggings are so so stretchy. I really really like this rib material because it's like that little bit thicker. You know that it's not going to be see through. Um, but it's still like so stretchy and so comfy and this colour is literally unreal, absolutely love it. Like I mentioned these ones don't have the scrunch bum so they're not quite as flattering on the bum um, but I mean I think they still look really really nice. And then we've got the top which you kind of get a better idea of what it looks like when I've got it on. Um, yeah I think it is just something a little bit different, again you've got like quite a bit of coverage like it's not it comes down quite far. To be fair, it's a little bit more supportive than what I was expecting, but I still would not want to be wearing this for like anything that was like high intensity. Definitely a weight session would kind of be the limit for this one, but I do think it's really nice. I would worry about these side bits sort of like sliding down if you started to get a little bit sweaty, because there's nothing to sort of like hold them. Um, so yeah, I don't know if you'd maybe need to like adjust it quite a bit when you're working out. I've not wore any of this stuff to the gym yet, so can't really comment on that. But yeah, first impressions, I really, really like this set. I think it's really, really cute. I forgot to say when I was talking through the other ones, um, but everything that I've got is like pretty much true to size. I just ordered my usual size and everything and they all fit pretty much perfectly. So yeah, we're finishing on a high note with this one. I uh, really, really like this. And those are the three sets that I picked up from Bow & Tee. Overall, I am pretty happy with everything. I have reviewed sort of Bow & Tee stuff in quite a few of my videos now. And I definitely feel like the quality has got better the longer the brand has been around. Like when Bow & Tee first launched, I picked up some of like their first bits. And to be honest, I wasn't really a massive fan. I think a lot of their stuff did feel quite cheap and it just didn't really like do anything for me. I just was not a fan at all. But as time has gone on, the stuff has definitely gotten 10 times better. Um, as you've seen in this video and the other videos, a lot of the stuff I personally really like. I think it's really good quality, really nice fit and really flattering as well. And it is quite nice if you want something like a little bit different to like your standard gym wear. They've got some really nice colours and some really nice designs. And it's not too expensive either. Um, it's definitely a lot cheaper than like Gymshark and Alpha Lee and Rider wear. So it's definitely like a little bit more on the affordable side than like a lot of other gym brands so yeah that is everything that i picked up from bow and tea i really hope that you enjoyed the video if you did remember to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't already um my videos will be going back to the normal wednesday at 5 p.m upload and there has been a lot of videos kind of in the past few weeks i've been trying to get all of like my florida vlogs up and i've been uploading those every other day but as of this video now all the florida vlogs are done it's going to be back to the usual wednesday at 5 p.m. one video a week every week um so yeah i will see you next wednesday for another video but yeah thank you so much for watching and thank you to bow and t for sending me those sets